Hey everyone, Clarky Shy here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm back today. I want to talk about if Black Ops Cold War Zombies will be better than Infinite Warfare. Now, as you know, I did make a video talking about Black Ops Cold War Zombies will be better than Black Ops 3 Zombies. There's going to be a part 2 to that for when the game comes out and I've gotten a good feel of it and then I'll come back to that video as a part 2. But the reason why I'm saying Infinite Warfare is due to the fact Infinite Warfare Zombies, just specifically Zombies over the years, has been getting a lot more popularity due to Director's Cut, Zombies in Space Land, and a tiny bit of Raven the Redwoods. And just in general, people really liked the Super Easter Egg and how the actual game like went. They loved it how like the Super Easter Egg started you off with all the perks, 25,000 points, you can unlock secret characters every time you do the Easter Eggs. The Easter Eggs were really cool when it came to Zombies in Space Land and Raven the Redwoods. And the hardest boss fight ever in Zombies history. So the more like it's went on with Infinite Warfare, the more people have liked it. And most people now say that Infinite Warfare Zombies is underrated. Now, I just want to... And Infinite Warfare Zombies, as you know, never really focused on storyline at all. It mainly focused on the gameplay aspect, so it's fun for everyone. It's never cared about the story. They just went on with the gameplay with the arcane machines, Raven Red with his sprite colours, Shallon Shuffle with that Kung Fu feeling, and then Attack the Raid thing with that 1950s type type of thing and then uh, Beast from Beyond where it's all set in the future and then of course you got Mephistopheles too. So yeah they basically just went on with the gameplay and the reason why I'm specifically saying Infinite Warfare is because I think it'll be better than World of War due to the fact that World of War like graphics and how it works by then like I think compared to now most people would like Black Ops Cold War Zombies uh, or maybe I'm wrong I don't know I, I might be wrong I'm probably a dumbass at this point. Um, most people I do think would think it's better than BO1. BO2, I don't think I'll make a video on that just due to the fact that it's like, I don't know man, because loads of people do like BO2 due to Mob of the Dead, Buried, and most people like Transit now, people still hate fucking Die Rise, I'm sorry Johnny, and Nooktown, and just Origins, Mob, everything, like loads of people, a lot of people do like Black Ops 2. So I don't think there's a reason to make a Black Ops 2 Zombies video. When Black Ops 2 Zombies you have, half of the maps are like not like fan favourites and you have the other half which are good. So the half that I'm saying are not the ones that people like is Transit, Die Rise and Nooktown. And then the other half for good is Mob of the Dead, Buried and Origins. Those are the maps that people really like within Black Ops 2 Zombies. So I really don't know if I should really make a video on Black Ops 2 Zombies, but hey, it's a possibility, stay tuned. <laughs> but um, within Black Ops, within Infinite Warfare, it did really bring re a lot of fun to the table. Heck, it got a lot of hate, but like, literally, ask any zombie shooter right now, and they will, well, maybe not every single zombie shooter, but most zombie shooters now, they would probably say IW is underrated due to the fact that the director's cut, the hardest zombies boss, it's just really cool with what Infinite Warfare did, and I honestly really do find Infinite Warfare zombies fun, and um, I just like, if they can bring that funness within Black Ops Cold War zombies, I can see it being a big possibility, and honestly, it's like, I don't know man, because like most people now really like how Infinite Warfare Zombies did it, because they didn't focus on storyline that much, they mainly focused on gameplay. But let's take Black Ops 3 here, like I said in the previous video, Black Ops 3 Zombies did the best. Black Ops 3 mainly focused on gameplay, but dead sto but dead story as well. And here's the thing, one of Black Ops 4's problems was that it did focus on storyline over gameplay, and that's why Blood's like one of the best maps for storyline wise. So yeah, that's one of the problems BO4 has, and I really hope they do it on Black Ops Cold War Zombies. And from what it seems like, that's what they're going for. They're just messing around with the gameplay, putting score streaks and that in there. And the only thing I see a problem with, like I don't see people having troubles with the War Machine or like the Century. The only problem I see from people uh, about score streaks is the Chopper Gunner. But honestly, boys, if an RCXD is in Zombies, that's gonna be fun as hell. <laughs> it's gonna be super fun, but. I think they kind of want to go in a way where they're mainly focusing on gameplay and just messing about with it. They, again, they've already got a team ready, they've already like working on stuff and changes from what the community have said, so they're already on the rule. So depending on like what people don't like the most or just something that they need to fix in due to glitches, they'll be already on the ball with this game because Black Ops 4, as you know, they never really fix many stuff when the game released. They, it, it took like a month to fix a lot of things. And heck, Black Ops 4 Zombies, yeah, it's good now due to like, there's not even been as much game crashes as there is now, unless you're swift. But apart from that, it was alright. 
And honestly, like, every war for zombies never really had much game crashes, but loads of YouTubers had fun with it when Zombies of Space on, playing it uh, early at COD XP. There was just a lot of people that had fun with IW Zombies, so I can definitely see uh, having a big possibility that can be better than IW Zombies. And, it, like, the thing is, though, another problem with IW, like, again, I they really never, like, cared about the storyline in this game. They just mainly wanted to focus on gameplay and making it fun. If they make the storyline good within this game, because it's stuff from the Dark Aether is leaking into the new universe, that's how the story's going to work in Black Ops Cold War Zombies. So, if they make the story right, and they mainly focus on the gameplay over storyline, but, yeah, again, make the story super good, where people can follow up from tag to toe if you do know the story well, then this will be good. This will be a really good game. It will get you interested in the story. It will be fun, man. It will be fun. So, honestly, I can definitely see uh, Black Ops Core Zombies being better than Infinite Warfare due to the fact that it will have a better storyline. Because Infinite Warfare Zombies never had the best storyline, but the gameplay was on point. So, as long as they make better gameplay than IW Zombies and a better storyline than IW Zombies, well, heck, a lot of things can make a better storyline than IW Zombies. Even though, like, this, like the reason why I'm saying the storyline wasn't that good is because when it comes to new zombies games and new zombies storylines, normally we get the background of our characters, what they did, what they do, hobbies, age, and stuff. And in this game, we never really got to know, like, what our characters have done in the past and stuff. It's just, like, there are characters, they're visiting Willow Wyler, they are now in a movie, but it turns out to be a shit show. So, that's all it really was. Simple, but... Yeah, so Infinite War for Zombies did have a story, but it just wasn't really focusing on the story. So as long as they focus on storyline, not as much as gameplay. I I think everyone mainly wants Treyarch uh, to mainly focus on gameplay this year compared to Black Ops 4. So as long as Treyarch mainly focus on gameplay and put a tight put in storyline, or just do what they did with Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3 storyline was perfect, and like with Black Ops Cold War, they can literally do the same mainly focus on the gameplay aspect, making it fun for everyone with rewards and stuff, and then just add in that storyline where it can get people interested for those storyline people out there. And I can see that being a big possibility due to the new Intel system, so if there was a new Intel system within Black Ops Cold War Zombies now, and then when you get said uh, certain unlocked um, Intel, you get rewards on demand anytime. So, it's storyline, people, you're in for a treat this year, so I think storyline is good for this year, it's just really the gameplay, and honestly, Infinite Warfare Zombies gameplay was just really fun, so hope to god, I really do hope they can do it better than IW, because Black Ops 4, as much as I do like Black Ops 4 Zombies more than IW, IW's gameplay was literally on point, so Black Ops 4 Zombies, I'm relying on you, Treyarch, don't let us down, we, we, we have faith in Treyarch, we have faith in Treyarch. Uh, but anyways guys, thanks so much for watching, if you did enjoy, please subscribe, leave a like, click the notification bell, always to the channel. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think. Do you guys think this will, do you guys think Black Ops Cold War Zombies will be better than Infinite War for Zombies, just due to the points that I named off in this video? And let me know if you want to see if I should make a video on, will Black Ops Cold War Zombies be better than Black Ops 2? Let me know in the comment section down below. But anyways guys, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video live stream boys, and goodbye!